gonna leave a mark. So, this must be the basement of the Orbital Malik's laser. Which means that the Stornator should be somewhere nearby. Mr. Norton, we have a situation over here. So what have you discovered, Mr. Void? Looks like Optical Illusions gave the Malice script a few targets. Such locations include Viresha, United Laws of Rafika, and Tequin Island, just to name a few. Dear, <laughs> back. If we have touched the United Laws of Rothica, our allies at Markosoft will be incapacitated. Then again, if Russia gets hit, Kaspersky will be KO'd instead. Regardless which target Malik hits, one of our allies is gonna get KO'd with it. And what about the Tequin Islands? Do you remember your feisty girlfriend, Junko Ishikawa? She'll be hit by Malik as well. Should Malix choose the Tequan Islands? Well then, looks like I'm screwed either way. That is, unless I can destroy the laser beforehand. Mr. Bard, may I remind you that this laser is heavily guarded by nanobots, R8 soldiers, and that pathetic excuse of AR software. If you do decide to go antiviruses blazing, you risk infection towards you and the script's programmer, Phoebe. Understood, Minister. As for Phoebe the Cow, do you have any idea where they're keeping her? Well, looking upon the security footage provided by Minister Immunet, she's currently being held in the control center where all the control panels are located. Thank you very much, Minister. Wish me luck. Render the Malik's laser inoperable for now. Mr. Supreme AI! What's going on? Ah, use Elizabeth Rex. Perfect timing. Are you truly prepared for the most difficult task I'm about to bestow upon you? Yes. I will not fail you. Very well. Now listen up. The Blueberry Boy has been captured and is being held in the basement of this very laser. What? He's here? I thought I left him back at the UAV! Apparently, the boy managed to use a glide cycle to fly up here to the laser. My point is, if the Blue Boy is here, that means his UAV lackeys must be here as well. Therefore, if you should encounter them, eliminate them immediately. No worries, sir. I'll stop him. Oh, Blueberry Boy. Such an adorable little fool. Yet she fails to realize that once Malix it's I'll be using the laser to attack her hometown as well. So that in the event that she completes her mission, she will lose everything she ever had. Which begs the question. Have you ever doubts with the devil under the weak light of the moon? Pray for your disc. Mr. Suprema, the Malix laser is ready to fire. Excellent! Nanobots, prepare to fire! Heh, <laughs> big mistake by trapping me in the basement with those storinators. Now let's watch some fireworks, shall we? What in the hell happened to the Malik?
Supreme Officer, the Manic Slicer appears to be malfunctioning, sir. Looks like the storage is in the basement of Infant with a server error. Damn it! The Blueberry Boy must have disabled the storage. This will leave the Manic Slicer incapacitated until further notice. But why didn't any of you mention this sooner? Surrounded by innocents! Fine! I'll fix the laser myself! Not so fast, Supreme AI. <laughs> Supreme AI, this is your last chance. Surrender Phoebe and the Malik script, or face your deletion. You're too late, Mr. Void. Sure. You scored a few points by disabling my Stormators, but it's not over yet. I've successfully restored the Malik script to the previous snapshot through the last System Restore point. As long as System Restore remains active, the Maliks will still be operational, even if the basement servers aren't. As you can see, your little cow friend is tied up at the moment atop the Malik's laser. And thanks to the intel which she provided, her services are no longer required. Get back here, you stubborn nanobot! Phoebe, oh Phoebe, are you okay? Yes, sir. I'm alright. Thanks to you, I didn't suffer much damage. But I think a trip to the doctor could be very useful right about now. Don't worry, Phoebe. I'm here to get you out of here. I promise. Boy! Look out! Behind you! laser again. Only this time, let's use the laser on the Blueberry Boy himself. Nanobots, prepare to fire. Yeah, it's me. Yeah, it 
Bastard. I don't understand. How in the hell did the Malich Laser fail to fire a second time? Answer me! I can answer that question, you pathetic piece of roadware! You see, ever since you kidnapped me, I kept with me a copy of the Malik script. The same script I just used against your laser without any human intervention. As I always say, thank goodness for backups. Baby, are you okay? Are you hurt? I'm alright! Now come on! Let's get out of here! What happened, Minister? The Brits and Turgium, the Malitz programmer, has escaped. Thanks to my son, therefore, it's about time we raise the stakes to this operation, shall we? Bring my son's fights to me. It's time to break the disantivirus robot once and for all. What? Minister? Yes, what about Supreme AI? Mr. Fritz is still in him as well. We get him from the equation. Yes, Minister. Right away, sir. After temporarily disabling the Orbital Molex laser as well as the Supreme Eye, Phoebe the Cow has finally been rescued by Void Ranger, and the Molex script has been recovered. What does Total Obi's new plan have to do with Void's fiancé Princess Liz, and will Void be able to rescue his fiancé from the evil forces of optical illusions? Don't miss the next episode of Axel Rangers S.